Hey Rifters, Cymatic Bruce here. Uh, kind of sharing something uh, that uh, is pretty <laughs> interesting. Um, so I'm kind of into ASMR videos. Uh, a few of you out there might be as well. Um, basically, it's these videos that have certain triggers that uh, kind of get you to um, have this really pleasant, tingly feeling in your brain, I guess, and you know, all over. Um, and they're kind of weird, kind of personal attention videos that have kind of exploded on YouTube uh, as of late. And uh, some users have gone really the extra mile uh, to uh, present a really cool experience. And it just so happens these experiences translate very well to VR. Um, so what I'm going to demonstrate here is uh, one of the videos that were recently um, released by Ali, ASMR requests. Uh, she did a great video as a part of her sci-fi series and it's really exceptional, really well done. Um, so I'm going to do this from VLC. I'm going to go ahead and go open stream um, and uh, put in the URL here so it starts from the beginning. And uh, I have a dome projection here uh, that's on the video. And uh, it's really cool because everything is meant to be kind of from a first person view anyway. So you like you zoom through this logo she has and you open up on the earth. I mean it's not stereoscopic 3D because her videos set in 2D. Uh, but the way things are it's like you know departure and you can look around and read the word. Um, it actually is pretty impressive even for being kind of a 2D experience at this point. Um, I'm going to fast forward a little bit and go to a part where, let's see, it kind of... Um, I don't want to come back here to find you. I'll move it around here. All right, so this is actually a good part here. So it's kind of, you're in a, a sleeping pod, like a sleeping capsule, and it has like this screen interface, and you look around, and it's like, you know, you can see like the edges of the capsule, right? And uh, so it's if you don't move too much you won't actually see the edges of the screen too much it actually just looks like you're looking at the edges of a capsule which is pretty cool and you're able to kind of look around and read all the information that's printed on the the windshield quote unquote of this cap, uh, capsule that they have um, and uh, then it's going to open up so Array, this is great from a first person point of view. Uh, if this was you know, translated to a 3D experience and it was in VR, this would be pretty impressive, um, or even more so. Um, but uh, yeah, I thought it was a pretty cool experience. Are you comfortable? Yes. Good. Thank you. The temperature of your cryo bed, is it to your liking? It is. Wonderful. Oh yes. What's behind you there? <laughs> it certainly looks smaller from here, doesn't it? Absolutely does. It's as though you can watch all your cares drifting farther and farther away until they've disappeared altogether. Fantastic. Um, so it's soon they will. Your vacation with departure space tour. That is an example of what's going on um, with uh, some of these videos and, and using VR player. Uh, to kind of get that experience and uh, I would really like to see this type of experience move into full 3D uh, but I think a key thing is the binaural audio we have to have that like I'm really uh, hoping that we'll see some binaural audio projects um, come to fruition soon I'm no, I'm no, I don't know what happened to VRSDIR um, they were very promising and then they just kind of disappeared uh, but I would hope to see someone step up and and take on that challenge um, because yeah the, that's a very key component of that relaxation being able to um, have that uh, binaural uh, component uh, to these videos so very cool just kind of a quick quick snippet of something that I found that was uh, very neat and uh, any of you that are having trouble sleeping out there this might be just the ticket <laughs> All right, excellent. So, until the next VR experiment, it's been an absolute pleasure. Signing out.